What's up, Zara fam? It's your boy Ryan, and today I got a brand new video for you guys. And what I got for you guys today is by what you see. What you see from the title is an exclamation about what actually happened on Thursday. So, by what I'm saying at the beginning, you guys are probably thinking, "Oh, it was actually like a fake video or something." It wasn't a fake video at all. Some people in my school thought it was a fake video. It wasn't at all. So, like some people were thinking, like, "Oh." Like, when I showed the trunk at the beginning of the video, like, maybe you could have put the bike in the trunk, like, before, like, before my dad went off or anything to make it actually believe when he came home, we'd see the bike in his trunk, but that's not true. Like, I kind of messed up because I should have, um, went in his van to, like, record everything of what happened because then it... Like, no one would be thinking it would be fake at all. But trust me, it was not, the video was not fake at all. Second my of all. My dad even said that the guy put his hands up. Yeah, He like, probably thought my dad was a he cop. He was actually, like, so, like, he was so scared, the guy. Like, like, the guy, like, it, he was obviously guilty. Like, we don't 100% know, like, what happened. We don't know if he was the one who stole it or if maybe someone else stole it and like gave it to him or something but like that kid the kid that stole it looked young but my dad said like there was something wrong with him he was like messed up or something but like also some other people go up to me and be like why were you like crying so much in the video like that's my bike and to see someone steal like who's the person who stole my bike, actually riding my own bike and riding away from me, that just got me so pissed off. And like, that's why I was crying so much and like cursing so much. Like, I was so pissed off at the guy, like for not stopping. Like, we were yelling so loud that it was my bike. And like, he even knew that it was my bike because when when he was going across the street, you guys weren't able to see it. But like he was going so slow, and then when we started yelling, he started he started like going off like as fast as he possibly could. It was just I could still remember it like it was it happened like five seconds ago. It was just, what happened was just insane, and I'm so happy I got my bike back. But like. Kara, do you have anything to say about this? Not really. I mean, we we did get security cameras now, as I was talking about in the video. I'll actually show you guys, like, one of the security cameras. There's three outside. I don't know if you're able to see. You should see because it's in the light. There's one right there. So if anyone that watches my videos, do not come around my house. Because we do have if security you cameras bike, now. Do not come around my yeah, and we also have two. Like you guys can't see, but it's, yeah, it's pitch black. But there's like two more, like on the side of the house. You know where my you basketball where the hoop? Are? Yeah, you know where the windows are by my basketball hoop. Like there's two other, there's two more there. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. Like, no one come around here because you're gonna kind of be screwed. Because now we have security cameras and on. Thursday in the video, we did not have security cameras, but, like, my dad had me end the video early because he, like, he was, he, dad, you said you were going to be cursing a lot, right? No, I'm not going to curse. No, like, um, when, like, you told me to end the video early, like, you thought, like, you, you were, like, going to be cursing a lot and stuff. Well, like. yeah, I didn't want, I didn't want anybody to see that. Because mm. I was mad. I was yeah. very, very, very angry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You heard it. Uh, like, I don't know why that person would, like... I, we still don't know... Again, we still don't know if he was the one who actually stole it, but my dad said he looked messed... He was, like, messed up. We also don't even know who it is. Like, so. we, we've we never seen that person before. Like, all the people were thinking it was a skit, like... It was, like, staged... But we've never seen that person before in our life. So we've never seen that person before. And it was, like, really strange to see, like, a stranger, like, riding my bike. Like, at first, like, I couldn't process what was going through my head at the time. Because I was actually, like, like, I wasn't being emotional at the beginning when I saw a kid. Because, like, 
I was trying to make sure it was my bike because I didn't want to be emotional just for it not being my bike. But guys, so if it was one of our friends doing it, we would be mad, but we wouldn't be as mad as we were at the guy because he was a stranger. Yeah, like, that guy was like, that guy's an idiot. I don't know if you're, whoever did that, if you're seeing this video, I don't even care if you're seeing it, like, shh. Get off, like, click off this video right now, whoever. If if you actually see my videos, like, if he knew about my videos and he actually, like, stole my bike just because it was out there, like, it's kind of messed up. Like, really messed up. But it was just, if it was a stranger just finding a bike, like, I'm just still trying to process, like, what ended up happening. It happened, like, two days ago because I'm recording this on a Saturday night. You guys are probably going to see this on Sunday. Hey. What? Wrap it up. So, like, I just wanted to, I wanted to touch base on all of, like, what ended up happening on Thursday, like, that's gonna be one of the worst slash best days of my life. That like, that was a weird day. Yeah. That like, was. I was happy that day at school, but when I got home and Ryan's bike was in there, I was like, like I literally have before feelings, like the video. Like, Kara asked me if I wanted to like ride my bike and stuff. If Kara never asked me that, like, I'm not even looking for my bike at all. And what ended up happening also, like, I was recording two videos before, but I messed up in the videos, so I had to restart. So if I kept on doing those videos, I would have I would have never, um, I would have never been recording when that person came across. But luckily I was for, like, the actual video. And guys, by the way, on that video, I just want to thank you guys for all the support. Like... It's insane, like 1,000 views on a video in like a day for me, like, that's just that's insane. insane. Like, I, I'm just lost for words, like, I'm actually trying to process also, like, how did we get 1,000 views on that video in less than two days? Yeah, it was less than two days. The video's been out for two days now, but I hit, one, I hit the 1,000 view mark before before um, I hit like the second day of being out. But <sighs> that was just really hard. That was like a mixed emotion day. Like it went from being like the like an okay day in school. I didn't have the best day in school, but I had an okay day in school. And then coming home to like not like seeing my bike was just so it was so bad like when i couldn't find my bike at all like i knew i effed up because i left it out and i knew like like i actually thought like the night before i put it back i th i guess it didn't because he was focused on the yankee game yeah that's what i said in the right. video. i actually was but no one wants to watch a 15 minute video <laughs> cut it off Start it's over. eight minutes eight all right eight minutes <laughs> See, you're rambling on, man. I'll, I'm explaining what the whole thing that happened. Though. All right, well, I think you should cut it off. <laughs> That's just like saying like what happened in the other video, Dad. <laughs> like anyway, I don't even know what to say anymore. Like. That's just stupid what the guy did. Like, like, like there was this one kid in the comments. Like, I know the kid. Like, he was just asking. Like, it's only a bike. Like, why? Why are you crying? You know, you know who you are. You know, you know who you are. Who said that? I know who who said that also. But he was like. Like, why are you, like, it's only a bite. Like, why are you crying? Like, that's, like, stealing anything. Like, that guy was a stranger. Like, stealing anything from someone you don't know, especially, like, a bike. Like, that's just, 
That's pathetic. Like that's why? messed up. Yeah, that's messed up. I just wanted to touch base for you guys. So I hope you guys understand like the whole situation since we had to end the video early. Like I wanted to explain like the rest of like what happened. Like my dad basically went up to him and was like, if you don't drop the bike, I'm gonna kill you. Well, oh, now what's going through your head is, oh, my dad should be in jail right now because he threatened the kid. No, he shouldn't be in jail because the kid stole something. Like, if you if you go up to the guy for no apparent reason, say if you guys got in an argument and you threatened to kill him, then that's a whole different thing. But the guy, like, stealing something? Like, that's two different things right there. So, I just, again, I had to touch base on this. So, hope you guys understand where we're coming at. Make sure to like this video. Subscribe if you haven't yet. We only have, we only need 18 more subscribers. Right now, while we're recording this, we have 82 subscribers. So, we only need 18 more until 100 subs. And we're probably going to do a 100 subscriber special. That's, Thursday's video was insane, guys. I don't have anything else to say, so it's Ryan. And it's Kara. And we're out. Peace.